September 16th through the 30th, 2018. Thank you so much for taking time out to watch this video. Please be sure to show me some love with some thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, please be sure to click subscribe. And for those of you that already subscribed, thank you so much. I do appreciate that. If you guys would like to know when I upload a new video or go live, please be sure to click that notification bell next to the subscribe button. And you know what? I'm going to put this up real quick. any restrictions to your availabilities. All right, Cuspers, let's get started. All right, I will change the signs in the corners to let you know when I'm changing. So Aquarius, Pisces. Aquarius, Pisces, air, water, Aquarius, Pisces for September 16th through the 30th, 2018. This is a bonus information video. Please be sure to watch your Aquarius and or Pisces video for um, additional information. This information is just to go along with those videos. Be sure to show me some love with some thumbs up on this video. I'm hearing I need to pull that one. Ooh. Okay, what is up with this? So if you guys don't know, this particular deck I do not keep reversals in, and we did get a reversal. Um, so I don't know what's going on here if there's just a few cards have been put in reverse but that's very interesting so obviously right away with the five of wands which it wanted to come out here I, it always sucks okay I, I don't want to see anybody stuck in conflict with the Emperor here Next to it, it, it feels like you're fighting the system, okay? It feels like somebody is wanting you to fall in line. There's some expectations that are being put on you. And what they're doing is they're pro someone is projecting their expectations of themselves upon you. They are wanting their life to be a specific and certain way and since it's not they're going to want your life to be a specific and certain way so it feels like right now you're just kind of fighting for control of yourself here and I don't I don't want you guys to feel that because that's not a good feeling here so remember setting boundaries setting boundaries setting boundaries setting boundaries here okay this with the emperor he is the father so I'm I'm wondering if this is about your family okay you know I'm just gonna tell you this Pisces Aquarius Cuspers the more you fight this the more closed-minded the situation is going to become for the other person here you arguing, you fighting, you trying to force them to see your way, that's not going to help anything. You're not going to really get what you're supposed to get out of this situation. Um, I don't think you're ever going to see eye to eye about whatever the situation is with your family. So right now, this is just about setting boundaries and saying, hey, you don't agree with me, and that's fine. 
I accept that. And now it's time for you to accept that I don't agree with you. Because is this really worth a family dispute, a heartache, of not speaking to each other, of, of you know, just this building walls between each other? Is it really worth it? Because, you know, you guys, most likely it's not. So just because you're not going to see eye to eye doesn't mean that you can't say, hey, stop pushing me. All right. Gemini Cancer. Gemini Cancer. Gemini. There you are. All right. Gemini Cancer Cuspers. Right, Gemini Cancer Cuspers, remember this is a bonus video, bonus information to go along with the Gemini and or Cancer video. This information needs to be combined with the information from the other videos, all right? Um, and show me some love with some thumbs up on this video. Oy, oy, oy. Okay. I feel like you're recognizing some things here. I don't feel like it was an easy path. I don't feel that way at all. I don't feel like it was an easy path to get from point A to point B. I do feel as though that you are regaining what you need to be you again. I, I, you know, I just, I feel like you're going to have days where you're just going to feel like, what the fuck? And then you're going to have other days where you're going to grasp onto that Gemini side of you, that Gemini energy with you, and you're just going to tear shit up. You're like, I know what I want. I know what I need to make me happy, to make me fulfilled. I know what I need to get back what I've lost. That portion of me, that piece of me, that, that smidget of my soul that I feel as though somebody tried to rip away from me. I'm, I'm owning that shit and I'm getting it back. And I'm not allowing anybody, you know, to mess with me. You'll go back and forth because, you know, that's what rebuilding's about. Rebuilding that, what you need is about wavering on your confidence. Um, but it can also be about having too much confidence or being overconfident. So take your time, pace yourself out. And just let everything happen naturally and the way it should happen. All right, Libra Scorpio Cuspers, Libra Scorpio Cuspers. All right, remember this is a bonus video to go along with the Libra and or Scorpio video. So please be sure to check those out. Show me some love with some thumbs up. 
on this video. Leave this one out. Okay, they're saying leave that one out. Interesting. So you guys had the two come out as well. I don't like them sideways. I want them to give me cards that aren't sideways. Thank you. Those are sideways. <laughs> Libra Scorpio Cuspers, it does find, it feels like that for you to find your balance, for you to find your harmony, for you to find your progress, your strength, and your productivity, that this is about you learning to let go for the remainder part, remaining part of September 2018 here. It feels like this is about you letting go. Of your pride. The bottom, okay. Yeah. <laughs> You're holding on to your pride way too much here. You're holding on to the past. You're holding on to grudges. You're holding on to hurt. You're holding on to pain. And the only way for you to come out here where it's going to make any sense I just feel like fair to say I don't feel like it's gonna like all of it's gonna make sense but for you to make any rhyme or reason or sense out of this you're gonna have to let go of your ego and just accept that there's some things that you don't get answers for I'm feeling lots of ego here lots of ego now keep in mind this could be happening to you or you could be implementing this I read this as though you're implementing it so keep this in mind general energy will not resonate with everyone okay um, but it just feels like you for you to get what you want you're gonna have to just let go the more you try to hold on to this situation and squeeze this situation, the quicker it's just going to fall through your fingers. You know, squeezing, like squeezing mashed potatoes, it's just going to come out of your fingers. You know, if you want to hold the mashed potatoes, you're going to have to do it gentle like it was a uncooked egg. If you squeeze it, the yolk's going to come out the shells are going to break and stab you in the hand. You gotta let it go. Let it go. <laughs> You're going to have to just let this go. This is the only way for you to fight. You're going to have to trust in the universe that karma is going to solve these things out, work these things out. Keep in mind, the more you try to push karma, the more you're creating for yourself. It just, I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. I know this isn't what you want to hear, but you're, you you got to release this grasp. All right, everybody who has stayed to the end, I truly appreciate each and every one of you very, very much. Popping up soon will be links to other videos. Please be sure to check out your full signs and follow me on Instagram and check out my new podcast that will be starting October 7th, The Skeptic and the Psychic, and that will be available on Spreaker.